There are several different test images that can be used to present the results of a lock-in thermography test. Single phase images, amplitude images, phase images, and cycle sequence images. Amplitude images display all temperature increases at any time during the cycle and are commonly used to determine fault location in the XY direction. Amplitude images are typically selected as the test image to update while a lock-in test is running. Single phase images display temperature increases at a specific time in the cycle. They can also identify areas that heat up at different times within the cycle, providing an approximate correlation with de defect depth. Single phase images typically produce the highest XY spatial resolution of all lock-in images. To show the single phase image at different times or phase angles in the cycle, drag the track bar and then click the show button or use the arrow buttons. Cycle images display device heating at a specific time during the cycle. Cycle images are useful for visualizing heat flow across a device. To show the cycle image at diff different moments in the cycle, drag the track bar and then click the show button or use the arrow buttons. The currently displayed test image, the thermal overlay, and cycle sequence images can all be transferred to the main image for further processing. Phase images display the phase angle of heating at each point in the image. Phase angle represents the delay between powering a device and the resulting surface heating. When analyzing package devices and stacked die, phase angle is used to estimate the depth of a defect. When plotting multiple phase depth relationships on a device, it may be helpful to zero the phase of a heat source at a specific depth. This can simplify the depth calculations of other heat sources on the device. To zero the phase, enter a phase offset value that results in a phase value of zero. The phase image is created by calculating the inverse tangent of the single phase image at negative 90 degrees divided by the single phase image at zero degrees. If pixel values in these single phase images are below the noise reduction threshold, the resulting calculated phase angle will be noisy and unreliable. Noise reduction zeroes noisy pixel values by setting them equal to negative 360 degrees. The thermal overlay is a grayscale thermal image of the device that is merged with the phase image. Adjust the range of phase angles to merge with the thermal overlay. Optitherm Thermalize, thermal image analysis software. For more information, please visit our website.